Hi, welcome back to a brand new video of the Targeted Individual Program, Targeted Individual Experience. So got up this morning, still over here by Pam. My daughter is sick, she's home today. And uh, the New York Predator Department, again, have been heavily engaging in uh, remote no monitoring as well as surveillance in the home. And, um, you know, listening to my, through my, uh, computer into BCI computer brain chip interface and again trying to uh, send me this a message of extorting money from me and using Pam to do it you know uh, got up this morning again what she she what she do she was still here it was minutes to after 10 o'clock oh sorry minutes to 10 right now she's supposed to be to work at nine o'clock I understand she had to go to the pharmacy, but the pharmacy opened up at nine o'clock. She didn't go to the pharmacy until after 10. But while she was here, um, she would constantly, um, come, again, they were microwaving her. So uh, I, I got up a couple of times just to look out, look out of the bedroom and she was just standing there. And I'm just like, what's going on here? <laughs> okay. So again, now I'm looking at uh, some videos on YouTube and every time they mention, uh, like us, like numbers, particularly in the thousands, uh, they will start using the police um, sirens, right? And again, it's constant, constant, constant. Then through silent sounds, sending me a subliminal message that uh, they're going to, they're, they're trying to uh, extort money from me and using her to do it, right? Again, this is, so when I, like I said, I don't just experience what I experience, but I also understand the conditioning uh, that they've done to black people, particularly black women, where you see uh, now today, when it comes to black women, everything that they do is transactional, right? They want to be paid. They want they want money, okay? So they'll tell you, well, if you date me, you, you need to you need to pay my pay my rent, pay this, pay that, pay this and that, right? <laughs> and it's 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 ridiculous, okay? They literally this is the programming taking place. They don't they understand what's happening. In the sense that they're being, they think this is God, but this is not God. This is the U.S. government. This is the racist on the police force and the U.S. government security agencies, the military, that are using this technology to condition you, right? It's called silent sound spectrum. Condition you when you're sleeping. And then what they do is that they condition us into a certain way. Yes, I talk about uh, Pam over the weekend. She was like, you know, uh, I want to go to Bali. I'm like, why, 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 what's in Bali? Why all of a sudden you want to go to Bali? And then uh, two days later, she comes back and she's like, I had a dream about I was in Bali and this and that. Then I go to Facebook and, you know, you see these women talk about Bali 2024. So what's going on in, 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 in Bali, you know? So whenever you see this happening, I particularly also on Facebook, what I've noticed that a lot of these black women that have these, their so-called businesses, right? <laughs> okay. And a lot of times you see them uh, on vacation, they're taking pictures by themselves. They're not by themselves. They're just taking pictures by themselves, right? But then if you fast forward, let's say you go a couple of months and you go back to their page and you look at the, their surroundings and the people who are their surroundings, you'll see white men, white women. And they're, this, they're the only black women within that group, right? So again, they're selected. Right. Not only are they selected to be used as gatekeepers, but they're selected to be concubines for white men and white women engaging in bisexual sex and, you know, what same sex lesbian type of shit. This is what they they've been doing. All right. Now, I, again, I have nothing against if you're gay or if you're bisexual, whatever, transgender, what have you. But what I do take issue with is the fact that there are people out there, racist white people who are purposely doing this, who are purposely conditioning black women and black men to be coming that way. And don't think that people can't be psychologically conditioned to be that way, okay? One, they can do it through trauma, childhood trauma. Two, uh, uh, sirens, fire trucks, <laughs> exposing their shit. So now they come up. Two, drugs. Talk about these designer drugs, right? Go to a party, you know, particularly white people. They're, they're the most users of these kind of drugs, all right? Three, okay, the use of blackmail, extortion, okay, 
And so we have to be smart about these things. Talk to your children, talk to your kids. All right? Look at look look at how they move. Watch their mindset. I remember as parents, we have to put into our children what we want out of them. Okay? So that being said, I'll talk to you guys in the next video.